Alright, alright, before I even get started, I don't want to hear shit about which console is best and which controller is better. There's been a fucking war raging on between the tribes of Xboxville and Playstationopolis, but we all know the PC Master Race will wreck all their asses. Now that that's out of the way, I want to say that if you already have an Xbox or Playstation controller, there's no point in buying a Steam controller. It's a waste of fucking money at that point. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to use your PlayStation 4 slash DualShock 4 controller for Steam games. Other YouTubers' tutorials are going to tell you to download this driver or install this software. But no, you don't need to download any of that shit. All you need is your PS4 controller, a micro USB cord, and a bit of fucking common sense. First, naturally, you take your micro USB cord and, well, I don't know, plug your PS4 controller into your PC? Jeez, this is some pretty tough stuff. Anyways, I'll stop being a dick now. Your PC will probably say something about installing device software or whatever. Just let it do that and you're almost golden. Soon your controller will light up and start to glow orange. The next part is to open Steam. Once open, there's a button in the top right shaped like a gaming controller. Click on this to open Big Picture Mode. Once in Big Picture Mode, navigate to the Settings tab. Once you're in Settings, look under Controller for Add Slash Test. This will open up the configuration menu for the controller. Pretty much all the buttons are already configured correctly. All you need to do is double check and fix where the settings don't match. Once finished here, save your preset and you're good to go. So yeah, that fucking easy. Just make sure whenever you want to use the controller, you open up games through Big Picture. All you need to do is open up Big Picture, go to Library, and select the game you want to play. No gimmicks and no complex software installations. Hope you guys enjoyed this video today. The rest of Toxicity and I have a ton of other tech tip videos. And if you're interested in this video, then I can guarantee that you'll find something on that playlist that you'll like. Also make sure to check out my personal playlist. This is where you can find all the videos that feature me, Toxicity Logan. We also post weekly content on Toxicity, at least four new videos a week. Make sure to check back often for new and original content. Again guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Still